Hey, what's up? Justin here. Welcome to 65 Drums. Today I'm doing a quick review of the M6 Pros from the company MME Audio. And this is the variation that comes with the custom molded ear tips and also the laser engraved logo on the face plate. Now, to be upfront, I did not buy these myself. The company did give them to me, but I'm not sponsored by them. I'm going to give you as honest a review as I possibly can. Just want to let you know where I'm coming from. So these guys right here, it's a really weird combination. Most of the time, if you buy custom molded in-ears from a company such as Westone, I have a pair of Westone UM Pro 30s. If you buy a custom molded pair of in-ears from them, it's gonna be like 500 or $1,000. It's not gonna be cheap. What this company is doing is they're trying to make custom molded in-ears a little bit cheaper. So you actually buy whatever body you want. You can buy the body that's like, the, the earbud that's like 50 bucks or 150 bucks, and then the, the cost of the custom molded in-ear is separate. So the custom molded in-ear tip part is about $150. They can scan your ear for free and print them out for you, or you can go to an ear doctor like I did, and then you mail them the ear molds, and then they'll do it that way. So you can either pay to do it or do it for free, but because I was nowhere near them in enough time to do this review, I just decided to go to the local ear doctor instead of flying to California or whatever event they were gonna do it at. The first thing I wanna talk about is what happens when it arrives in the mail. What do you get in the box? So in the box, you get quite a few nice things for basically an earbud that costs $50. So you get a very nice carrying case. It's a zipper carrying case. Inside it comes with an extra cable and it's four pole. That means that it has a little microphone on it so you can take phone calls if you swap out the cable for that version of it. So you basically have a backup cable in case this one breaks. I do like this, it's got a nice sturdy feel to it. It feels pretty high quality to me. Also in the box you get quite a few different kinds of ear tips, uh, triple flange ear tips, which I like the best. A lot of times you'll have to buy those separate off of Amazon for an extra seven bucks. What you're getting for 50 bucks is really, really nice. Let's talk about how it sounds. So I believe this is just a one driver in-ear. It was really hard to figure out how many drivers were in here because when you looked at the website, they literally don't tell you on the web page. But when I looked at the M7s, I could tell from the way they were describing it, the M7s are basically the M6s, but with an extra driver just for low end. And these still sound pretty nice. The best way to describe the way this sounds is that it's, it's got like a sonic V sound to it. So you have a lot of bass, a lot of treble, and the mids, they dip quite drastically. So there's not really that much harshness, and that's not necessarily a good thing. The, the mids cut out a little bit. It's not that you can't hear everything. It's just that it's not quite as balanced as I wish it would. Now, I have used this in a live environment with an acoustic drum set, and it, it performed just fine. I've also used these to record with my electronic drum set behind me, and it works just fine. So overall, it's kind of an odd pairing, to be honest because you have the in-ears that cost $50, and then you have custom molded ear tips that literally cost three times the amount that the actual you know, drivers cost. So to balance it out and get something that sounds a little bit better if you're thinking about going with this company, maybe consider going with the M7s. I haven't tried those out, so I don't know if they're good or bad, but I would rather go with the, tr with the two driver design if I'm already gonna sink 200 bucks into something. The fact that they laser engrave stuff is really cool. You can buy it either so that you can put your logo on it or you can just put your name on it, just a bit of text. It's really, really cool, to be honest, because I spent a lot of time designing this logo years ago. So to just open up this box and bam, there's the logo and everything. It's a really, really cool experience. Not necessarily worth it scientifically, but it does make you like the product even more. So it almost has an unfair advantage in my review, but just because it's got my logo on it. It's really, really cool. Okay, so taking a step back, what do I think about these in-ears overall? I think that you're getting what you pay for. Usually people use that in like a negative light, but I, I really think that's honestly the best way to describe these in-ears. I like that there's a company out there making custom molded ear tips for a low price. For 150 bucks you get them, and then you pair that with either $50 in-ears, bringing the price up to 200 bucks, or $150 in-ears, and then you raise the price even more than that. But for about 200 bucks, you can get something that is customized to your ear, and also you can spend a little bit extra money, put your logo on it or your name on it. I like this. I don't think that this product is for everybody, but I like the fact that there's a company out there doing this for a low price, and also the customization options. I do like this whole package. I'm also gonna be doing a review of these. So this is the company KZ. You can find these in-ears on Amazon quite a bit, 
And these actually have five drivers in each ear. And I think this was around $60 when I bought it, $70 when I bought it. Later, I'll probably be doing a, like a, I don't know, a comparison, a review of the $50 version without the ear tip. You can remove this really easily. I'm probably gonna do a versus video later on of these versus the KZ ones off of Amazon. So that should hopefully be a future video. Keep an eye out for that. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think of these in-ears if you've ever used them. Have an awesome day and I'll see you in a few.